everybody. Today we're going to be talking about Kennywood's three classic wooden coasters. These coasters have been in this park since the 1920s. We will be giving you some fun facts and you will be seeing clips of me or me and a friend riding it. The one of them actually Heather and I rode a few weeks ago. So we hope you enjoy this video and these are really, really fun. They're so classic. They're so different than the big steel coasters. But I gotta say, I really like them. So I hope you like the video and we will see you very soon. Bye. Jackrabbit. It opened in 1920. It's one of the oldest in the world and it's tied with the Jackrabbit in Seabreeze Amusement Park for the oldest in the U.S. The height is 40 feet, it drops 70 feet, and speed is 45 miles per hour. It's known for the double dip and produces a strong airtime and makes it feel like you will be thrown from the cart and as if the wheels come off the track. And I can verify, it feels like that. And you'll see our clip of us on it from a few weeks ago. It really does make you feel like the whole cart is flying off the track. Yeah, like it feels like you're not on the track for a second or two. So this is the Jackrabbit. It is really fun though, but I like a different coaster better. But this is one of Kennywood's three classic wooden coasters. First day we've seen the Raging Rapids open, just opened a couple days ago. They're just testing the like, units first, they're not letting anybody on it yet. Well, not even five minutes later and we saw, Heather saw kids running to get on this and she was like, oh I gotta do it. If you know Heather, you know she loves water.
kind of waterfall or big water splash moment over there. I don't know how well you can see it. Hey everybody, so I just rode the Raging Rapids. Oh my god, it was so much fun. I like wanted to go again. I didn't get too much wet, like the back side of me is wet because it like splashed up and went like under me. But uh, it was a lot of fun. I was happy to go on it. I kind of want to go on it again. But uh, we have some other stuff to do first and then maybe I'll ride it again before we go. But now we're going to ride the turtles, which is my favorite. Here we are. So here's this mural of the Thunderbolt right behind me. And um, so the Thunderbolt opened in 1924 as Pippin. And then in 1968, it received a big renovation and it reopened as the Thunderbolt. And it has a height of 70 feet and a drop height of 90 feet and then a speed of 55 miles an hour. So that's the Thunderbolt, and here's a clip of it. So in Kennywood, you can also stand under the Thunderbolt as it races down in this hallway here. And there's Jackie, and there it goes.
so this is a shout out to TikTok997, who is currently in Florida. Thank you so much for your kind comments. And we hope you like your shout out that we did for you. Here's a clip of the music from the carousel for you. Yes. And we hope that we could bring a little Kenny Wood to Florida. Have a great day. Kenny Wood put this new artwork out and it says to sit on top of the beer and it'll look like you're in the beer. So here's Jackie. This is a lot of fun, Kenny Wood. The racer opened in 1927 as one of the oldest in the world. It features a Mobius loop layout. Both trains travel along on a continuous track but each train returns to the station on the opposite side, which it began. It's 72 and a half feet tall. It drops 50 feet and the speed is 40 miles per hour. And of these three classic wooden coasters, the racer is my favorite. There's a duck right behind this picnic table. Hey everybody, so we decided to get a snack at the Rogue Barbecue and we purchased the pork nuggets and apparently it comes with like a coleslaw 
some sweet chili barbecue sauce. And, yeah, Jackie's gonna look up and um, probably put it in the description somewhere. But they look delicious. So we're gonna dig into this and we'll let you know. Okay, so we forgot to tell you about those pork nuggets from Rogue Barbecue. Heather liked them. I did not. The meat was really tender. It had a really good sauce on it. So if you're interested in trying them, they are really good. I personally just didn't like them. Um, they were pork nuggets with like coleslaw. I forget what else. I'll try to look it up again, but I couldn't find it online. So I'll definitely try to let you know the next time we come back. But anyway, that's a little tidbit about the pork nuggets. And if you try them, let us know. All right, guys. See you later. Hey, everybody. Today is June 9th, 2021. I have Ghostwood Estate behind me. But in honor of tomorrow being June 10th, which, if you know, the Velocicoaster officially opens in Universal Studios in Florida tomorrow, June 10th. Well, it won't be tomorrow when you see this, but tomorrow for me. So, here's my shirt. In honor of the Velocicoaster, I rode the biggest craziest ride here at Kennywood today and it's the steel curtain it's 220 feet in the air and it goes 75 miles an hour and I honestly can't say that I love roller coasters but I do like them they're fun I just hate when they're really high and I hate when they go straight down but it doesn't it's so sick so if you ever get to Kennywood you absolutely have to ride Steel Curtain, even if you're scared of heights. As long as you don't get dizzy on stuff, like, you have to ride it. It is so sick. I'm so proud of myself. I want to ride it again. It is amazing. All right, well, I think that's it for today. I'm gonna get out of here. But, happy Velocicoaster Day. And have a great day. Bye. All right, so Jackie's going to test out the steel curtain test seat. There's a light on this side, and when it's locked enough, it turns green up here. Hello everybody. So I am alone right now because Jackie is going to ride the steel curtain. 
I am going to do my very best to get her to be able to see her on it and get video of her on it. So hopefully that will be a success where she may have to write it a plethora of times until I get the perfect videos. I am so proud of her. Um, I know she's scared right now and probably freaking out, but I am just so proud of her for facing her fear and going on it. So let's see her on it. Okay, everybody, this is Jackie on the steel curtain. She's in the back row. So hopefully I'll be able to see her and get her on the video. There she goes on the big climb. Oh, she's probably dying inside right now and so nervous. Oh, she just texted me now. So she is texting me while she's making this climb. Oh, is she brave. It's not me. No, thank you. Oh, here she goes. Here goes my wife. So right over by the bumper cars, which is the Grand Prix, there is a new gyro cart. We have not seen this before. Not sure if it was here last weekend because I didn't come over this way. But as far as we know, this is new. So if you love gyros, definitely come check this out. All right, there's another little update for you. Alright guys, so this video was about the Jackrabbit, the Racer, and the Thunderbolt. If you've been in this park, let me know which one is your favorite. I think I already said my favorite is the Racer. So number one for me was the Racer. Number two would be this one behind me, the Thunderbolt. And then third is the Jackrabbit. I just didn't love feeling like I was off the track and the whole double dip thing. But it's such a classic ride. I mean, it's been here for such a long time, like a hundred years it has been here. But anyway, we hope you loved this video about the wooden coasters. We have another one coming soon. And we hope you have a great day. Bye.